And the blue band will soon be making their way to Arizona. Amy Lewis has more on how they're preparing for the big game. Two weeks of holiday break and now the Penn State Blue Band is back on campus doing what they do best. But they have a lot of training to do before their Fiesta Bowl ready. What makes a good performance? We asked band director Gregory Drain. It takes hard work, dedication, and, and, uh, and lots of practice. We're always talking about, you know, what it means, the sacrifices that they have to make. These next several days leading up to the bowl game will be strenuous and physically demanding. Tomorrow we will uh, arrive at 5 a.m. Uh, report time. Uh, we'll meet, get all our final preparations, final instructions, and then we'll bust down to Harrisburg. As soon as we land uh, in, in Phoenix, our first thing that we're doing is having another rehearsal. These students have never been to a Fiesta Bowl, but it doesn't damper their confidence. We're going to a place where a lot of people don't know the Penn State traditions. So when we march on the field, we spell out lines, we do pregame, we do the flip, we do our halftime show. All those traditions in there that they haven't gotten to see, it's something that we can show them. And I think collectively a lot of people like to see that. But what's most important is that they're excited and feel ready to show off their routine. And even though it's on a, a different stage, a different field, different fans, uh, it's still the same old show. Every single time we're getting better and better. They say going to a bowl game is always an honor. There's going to be millions of people who have never seen Penn State before, who've never experienced the Penn State Blue Band, who've never experienced Penn State football, and we want to make a great first impression on them as well. In University Park, Amy Lewis, 6 News.